Hey everyone, welcome back to SFDC Panther. My name is Amit. So in this video, we are going to talk about uh, what is the new project that we are going to launch. So as you can see that we are going to la uh, launch a new Salesforce development project and the project name is Event Management. That means we will be working on a software. We will be developing a complete end-to-end -end implementation for that software, which is called as Event Management. Definitely we are going to manage the events for uh, one of the company. We will talk about more whenever we are inside the lectures. So what is there inside for you in this project is for the admin development and we also have a surprise that is also included as a part of this project. So for the admin what we have is we have objects and fields inside objects and fields. There are two main concepts that we are also covering object uh, uh, fields that is master detail and lookup. We are also covering profiles, roles, OWD and sharing rules as well. For the developer perspective, what we have is we are developing triggers, batch apex, and we are also we have also included integration and LWC along with the community. So what kind of integration we have done or we are going to complete in this project is RESTful and Apex REST. RESTful means we are going to consume a third party web service and we are also going to expose our Salesforce data. And then what we have done extra is we have implemented an error framework as well, error handling framework. So this is a reusable framework that you can also use inside your real time project as well. And if you wanted to use, you can implement that is very helpful. Uh, you will be getting more information for that uh, in a separate video where we have developed this framework. And then as usual, I'm going to provide you the complete code for this project what we have developed at the end of this uh, course uh, where there will be a section you can get all those codes there so if you got stuck somewhere you can reference this code there so as we discussed that this is a complete project we are not working on the concepts so there are some prerequisites for this course what are the prerequisites are not as such you don't need to know in deep about all these topics but what you need to know is some basic knowledge about like Salesforce admin, how to create an object, a process builder or a field. Some basic information about the FS classes like how to create a class, variables or how to do the SQL queries on the objects. And then some basic of integration like how to consume a web service or how to expose. Even we have discussed those things. And then some basic information about LWC, how the, uh, like how you create a very small component, not that deep and then what are the communities and how to work with those. So these are the some basic prerequisites for this uh, project. As we already discussed that this is not a training session like uh, course we have this developed for the development perspective. And what good news is that after completing this project, you can include this project into your CV as well. And then you can tell the interviewer or the company you are going for the interview, say that you have worked on this project for one of your client. Or you can say if you are a college student, you can say that uh, you have developed this for your college itself uh, in to manage the events. That is very good example for that. So this will be a good learning for you all of you. I'll suggest go ahead and take this course. Thank you.